seconds. But now, OFCRA is starting to climb up in numbers again to be at about 130. So... Uh... Right. Well, it appears the Ion PMC have taken some Iraqi correspondence from uh, the post-Gulf War era and have somehow planted IEDs in Blue Force spawn, and unfortunately the Germans found one. Uh, looks like there were no KIAs though, but this APC has taken some pretty heavy damage. They had to take a spare wheel out and repair it. That's going to put them a little bit behind. Thankfully, there were uh, a few casualties that got caught in the blast, but overall, it uh, it should be fine. Maybe. Possibly. I could be wrong though. <laughs> nope, that's definitely an Avstar. Uh, anyway. Wait a second. Ah, uh, okay, it was trying to fix itself, and then it didn't. That is quite unfortunate. Ah, uh, they appear to be stuck. We do a little bit of lagging here, but yeah, as you can see, it's people connecting and reconnecting. And this a lag spike has allowed the blue four vehicle to blow Hello. through the ambush, and op four doesn't even realize it. Oh no, this is gonna leave the APC vulnerable. Oh my god. We do a little bit of lag here. Looks like they're calling out the uh, contact here. APC is dismounting. Lead. We got Hawkeye over here. Most of his team is actually dead. They were. Uh, oh, interesting. So by joining late, he escaped the fate of his entire team by the Lynx earlier. Isn't that cute? Helicopter still marauding around, but again, these guys are going to stick to the tree line. I'm impressed. I'm not impressed. I'm a little dissatisfied that Op4 doesn't have a defensive line in that uh, tree line here. Because out of every route to get to the regional HQ... Did you just... They're deploying Nubass by air. Except he's completely off course. Oh god. The risk is calculated, but man, oh man, is Nubis bad at math. I'm a little worried about this man. Uh, I think he forgot his parachute. <laughs> oh my god. He survived. He somehow spawned on his own body. Ah, oh, you know Team Fortress 2? You know the spy has the uh, that one thing, the Dead Rainer, where uh, they can activate their cloak and make Send it look like they died and turn six. invisible for a few yeah. moments? I think that's what he did. And they're gonna drive right into another kill zone. Excellent. However, the Lynx can overwatch him. And I think this guy is intentionally driving around to try to draw the fire out from the Lynx. And the Lynx has to be running out of ammo at this point. They just pointed out the Fox driving in. And Toxic is going to disable it. Woo! Their engine's down, but they can glide down. Uh, they could honestly glide all the way down into here and have a little bit of cover. But no, the engine, the brakes kicked in. And uh, now they're stuck. The question is, can the Lynx... Pro oh. Oh. That was a close one. Can the Lynx cover the infantry here as they burn to death? Okay, never mind. Uh, yeah. Oh, God. Always gets flown from the vehicle. And then the vehicle's like, wait, come back here. I'm not done with you yet. All right. Please check the building. Oh, he hears him. Oh, he hears him. <laughs> They're calling they just killed the commander. Oh my god. These chuckleheads. 
<laughs> These chuckleheads. You got Sanchez firing outside of this building here. His battle buddy goes down. And he is quickly breached, tries to lunge for the German's gun, but unfortunately the German mag dumped him. And he gets double tapped. Op 4, meanwhile, are dismounting right behind the Major Blue 4 group and are getting smacked. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They're, yeah. They, excuse me. When I said dismounted behind Op 4, I meant dismounted in between Blue 4. My bad. Will he shoot the window and toss a grenade inside? He's debating it. He's thinking about it. Is he going to do it? He does not. It looks like he tried to do it, but unfortunately he blew himself up with the grenade. And uh, yeah. We just heard AT fire and uh, hit something. Also took the vehicle out that these guys were overwatching with. Uh, and now that two story is no longer a factor, but wait. Wait, that's an OP4 vehicle and you just fired OP4 AT at the OP4 vehicle. Because there's two launchers. Um. Um. Ha. Huh. What? What are you? What are you? What are you? But. 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 What? No, but. 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 Damn, if only Op4 had a way to properly PID the enemy, if only the admin showed them what the enemies looked like in the beginning of the match, maybe that friendly fire incident could have been prevented. Wow. Anyway. Oh, Zixmi is still alive. But I just... Uh, uh, I did not cast or curse him. I did not. I did not. Caster cursing doesn't exist. I don't consider Zixmi the best. Well, I do consider him the best player. I just wasn't expecting him to lose that fight. Shush, shush, shush. I didn't caster curse him. Ah, so you didn't know now. All right, just making sure, broski, because I did. Helicopter flying by wide. Again, dodging that uh, AAA. Oh! Ah! Uh, yeah, he dodged all right. He's looping around for another run. You guys should probably get in that elephant grass. Ah, uh, yeah. yeah. What are you looking at? You know, that's a PPSH 9 by 19 Yeah. <laughs> the brave VC that could, and then he disconnects. <laughs> Did you try to get in a car and the car smacked you? Always have a battle buddy, guys. You never know when Sog Force is going through a town will plant booby traps like an automatic door opener. So here's what happened. See this little thing right here? This was a device that Sog... It killed him. So Sog basically put up a little tripwire right here. So when it detects a VC, it automatically opens the door and smacks them back so hard, it kills them. Goes a little far. Oh, but that gets a kill. This guy's head is uh, impaled on his rifle. Oh my god. That's uh That's not a good sign. <laughs>